Hey everybody and welcome to part 9 of Donkey Kong Country 3. So, to get to Pacifica you just go up this waterfall and of course there's another one here called Undercover Cove. Let's try it out. Yellow, red, blue, red, green, yellow. So, yellow, red, blue, red. Oh, I did it! Sweet! I thought I wouldn't get that one. More banana birds! Anyways, let's go to Pacifica, which is all the way up here in some water. And do dingy drain pipe. I used to say dingy drain pipe. So we have another drain pipe level. Which is, I believe, the fourth drain pipe level in the entire game. Also, we really don't need any more bear coins. I don't think we use them for anything. I guess if we wanted to do mini games, we could, but I'm not gonna be doing mini games anyway. Because we don't need the lives. Also, this is a really, really far away from the barrel of coin. This is a long pathway, but here's another one. 34 to 46. We almost have them all. Ooh. These uh, bristles are kinda out of position. Yeah, so everything in this level, or in this world, I should say, is water based, including the pipes. But, this pipe is actually kind of unique, because it's water, then it's not water. It's only, like, the, it's the only basic pipe level I guess you have in the entire game, because, like, normally you have, like, roller coasters, or low-G labyrinth, and stuff like that. Oh, darn it, I hit him. Get out of there before you get hit again, Dixie, and let's go to the bonus. And I believe most of these are collected stars, by the way. I really think they are. Gotcha. Yeah, we can actually go to Lost World after this. Or Krematoa. Krematoa just... Oops. Krematoa isn't very fun to say, you know? Um, I just get a free barrel, you know? Oh, I almost ran out of momentum. Kaploosh. Let's continue on through all these uh, lurching. I am not looking forward to the last level and the last boss, or in the final boss, or the world boss. Final level and the world boss. I really hate them. Terrible combination of levels. Difficulty wise, awesome. Like, they're, they're tough, but I don't know. I don't have much going for them. What the heck is the point of that? Like, you give me bananas to go up, like, there's something there, and then there's nothing there. So, why is that barrel there? Like, it's not underwater? Because guess what? The level isn't entirely underwater. The water recedes. Like, the water's just slowly draining from a pipe. Get it? It's kind of realistic if you think of it. I'm gonna grab the K this time. Also, I completely missed that jump. I don't even know how. Also, something down here. Right? Oh, lots of bear coins and bananas. Like, you don't even need more bear coins in this game, which is the funny thing. Why am I collecting that? I don't have the K. I'm weird like that. Also, I believe this is in guard. Why I risk taking the damage, being stupid, I don't know. So I swear you can't go back once you reach that point for some reason. I don't know what's like that. The fact that he only lasts for so long too is kind of weird. I wasn't expecting that. Whoa. Did you guys... Woo! They had too many gaps between them. I don't know why, man. Alright, let's try this in guard thing again. Kill the Coco, thank you. No, in guard. Really? I took damage? Dude, he's just floating off into the distance, like... Dixie, I'm, I'm dead! No! Don't fall into the lurching again. Actually, I think I remember what the last bonus is going to be. And I'm pretty sure lurchins are the answer. Whoa, there's the G. Maybe it's not lurchins. Maybe I'm thinking of just a different level. Maybe I am. 
Though you do need Dixie for that. Like Dixie and Kitty. See what I mean? Collect the stars. Also, you remember back in like the second game when you didn't actually need to collect every darn star in the entire bonus to get 100%? Yeah, now you do. And there we have enough to build a lost world now. We just have to beat the level, which I'm pretty sure we're at the exit of anyway. Very close to it after all these recoils. And a rocket barrel? Just just for the heck of it, we're gonna throw in some rocket barrels and some buzzes. And the end of the level. Easy. Now I just gotta answer a message. Real quickly. And done. Okay, so now we have Barnacles Island. What a beautiful shell! It's just what I need to finish off me collection! Say, Kongs, would you swap that shell for me, bird? You would! That's great! Here, look after this banana bird! There we go, there's 13 and that's it. That's literally it. Anyways, we have the final wharf level, or plank level, or whatever you want to call it, Stormy Seas. Yeah, it's a dark one with a really weird background. I feel like they didn't try hard for this one, but I really do like the level. Also, you can go in the water in this one. It's not like it has that evil fish in it or anything like that. Oh, bear coin. <laughs> I was going to just roll in the water for a bit there. Oh, hey, TNT barrel guy. Pretty sure we need to bl break the floor somewhere. Pretty sure that's where one of the bonuses is. Yeah, it's running at this recoil. So let's smash the floor. Boom. And bonus time. I didn't have the bonus music, sadly. Wait. Oh, I'm like, there's a fish? Oh god, this guy is relentless. Never mind, I guess it isn't all collect the stars. I wonder why they don't do more like find the coin. You know? I should need quite a few of these, but you do get a lot of time. I guess if they spawn like on the complete opposite side, right? And we did it. Fairly easy for it being the way it was. Hey, there we get the music, which honestly doesn't fit this level's design. Like, I'm gonna admit that now. The level design of this is good, but it doesn't really fit how they designed the uh, music, did the music around it, you know? I'm pretty sure the bonus is in the water at some point. Or maybe not in the water, but somewhere hidden. Could be here, there's a bounty bass. Mm, no, I'm pretty sure there's an, yeah, there's an in guard back there. Hey, Mr. Team to get, aw. Went into the water, sadly. Come with me. Barrel man? Oh, he died. Just straight up died. Hey, he rolls. That's very interesting. I always feel like the second bonus here is hard to find. Oh, you're dead. Oh. Is there supposed to know there's gonna be bosses down there? Like, there's, there's no indication that they're gonna be bosses. Yeah, I really feel like there'd be something down there. What? Dude, that barrel did not protect me at all. What kind of barrel is that? Also, what the heck was that? Also, what the heck is down here? Also, what the heck am I doing? Also, there's nothing down here, just bananas. I got a really itchy nose, so let me scratch that. Whoa, totally forgot that was where those two are. Like, I expect a lot of, a lot more hazards in certain areas than there really are. Oh, run! Whew. I don't get how that bounces. Yet when he touches everything else, he blows up. He's like a suicide bomber or like a terrorist of some kind, you know? Nothing down there, I gotta remember that. Oh, it doesn't work. Oh wait, I actually needed that enemy. 
At least the bonus is down here. Oh, I thought there was a point to those bosses getting in the way. Yes, there was. Anyways, we gotta find the coin. Wow, really? That is such a difficult bonus. It's a good joke, right? No! Can you, uh, come? Let's get him off screen. Ah, there we go. 35. We almost got all the DK coins, and we beat the level. So, good job, we're out of here. Let's go to the next level, which is Sunken Spruce. DK coin right away. Amazing. 36. Only 10 to go. Oh, wait. There's still three levels and five in the next. Plus the two last levels of the game in the Lost World. That's totally enough. Like, I don't think I'm going to do Funkies. Because nobody likes Funky, but. Yeah. Oh, there's a really fast. Coco. Fast? Really fast Coco down there for no reason at all. So, why did I do that? Why are there bounty basses if I can't destroy them? Normally they're only in levels you can kill. And I feel like in this level they just added them as a bulky enemy. Oh god. There's so many times I should have hit these enemies, but I didn't. So I'm content. I think it's one of these... I think it's this level. Or maybe like the uh, Rip Curl Reef level that's coming up that has the really difficult to get through uh, lurching area. Not really difficult to get through, just bonus or whatever it is that's blocked off. I should don't believe this level is supposed to be that hard to find everything. I believe it's all in the second half. This is a really weird level, though. And the addition of bazes everywhere is just awkward to me. Oh yeah, here's one of the bonuses right above three cocos. And we got collect 70 stars because 50 isn't enough. Wait, is it literally just an underwater collect the stars? There's nothing even special about this. There's no actual challenge other than making the time. Or if you're blind, I guess. Then any video game is difficult if you're blind. Okay, we made it through. Oh god, these guys are now just floating obstacles like that. Oh, there's nothing. Wait, is that literally just a... I'm gonna see a free DK barrel, but I don't think it's free anymore. <laughs> well, it still is, but... Wait, there's the last bonus. Also, randomly throw a minky in here. Let me guess, I'm just for randomly one spot too. Also, really easy to find bonuses, honestly. Also, the fact that like we're in the Atlantic, Atlantic, Atlantis area with um, darn it. This is the bonus that I was not looking forward to. Um. We're, like, Ad Atlantis is in the background, but yet we're in a tree. I didn't know Atlantis was that close to mainland. Whoa. Whoa. The worst part is this one, because you also... The thing is, is you also gotta go fast. Oh, we did it, thank god. Only one failure. Normally that level gives me a lot more hassle than that. I know Rip Curl Reef has a very annoying to find uh, bonus, but we're fine with it. So do I need the G? Oh, I actually did. Sweet, 79 lives. And then we beat the level. Now there's three more levels, right? Uh, 
Yeah, oh yeah, the cliff level's next. Cliffside Blast. This it kinda looks like a cliff. There we go. Well. Clearly looks like a... It clearly looks like there's something down here. Why? I swear they just wanted to add another barrel level into this game. It's like, this, level, this game didn't already have enough barrel levels. We need more. Or we need more, Nintendo. Or Game Freak. N Nintendo's like, Game Freak, we need more in this version. Even though that was like, literally the game. Okay, so I have a big complaint. Also, can you literally just do anything? The fact that I literally had no control of really. Okay, this is uh, a little annoying. I'm gonna admit that right now that I had no control over getting hit up there. Because you cannot see the enemies off screen. You can also not do that, please. Ah, I could just cheat like that. Thank you. Because otherwise, I'm not going to do anything. Wait, is this seriously the bonus? It's seriously the bonus. It's like, oh yeah, for a BS uh, barrel, blind barrel blaster where we get stung by a buzz, here's a really easy to find bonus. Except it's not really that easy because it has copters, I guess. So why collect the stars almost every time? Come on. Oh, there goes Diddy. I mean, Diddy. Dixie. There we go, the Kid Rock vibe again. I don't know why it gives me Kid Rock vibes, it just does. Let me know what you guys think it gives, or tell me what it gives you for vibes. Also, what the heck was that game? Also... There's the DK coin, 37. So what the heck is this one? Ouch. Wait, this is the checkpoint. Wait. Did I seriously just cheese the level? We'll just cheese the level for no apparent reason because I made this level really skippable. So, wait a minute, I see that over there. Oh, that is pointless. And I guess the barrel is literally just for the copter that shows up. Copters are everywhere. Copter! Stop blending in with everything, by the way. Uh, I want to go over there and see if there's a bonus, but... I don't think there is. No. There's the end. I got that, though. Oh, also nothing there. It's almost Christmas, by the way, guys. Man, you actually might see this on Christmas, so if it is... And Merry Christmas. If not, well then still Merry Christmas because, well, darn it. Then it's close to Christmas, so let's try this again. So I can't believe we cheese this part so easily, though. What the heck was that? And there's gonna be two there, you. Totally didn't uh, expect to. Why did you not grab the rope? I hold down the grab button, aka the run button, the entire time, and then the roll button. What? Oh, seriously? Copters. Kinda really an enemy that I like, that the game just likes to keep throwing in everywhere. Also, can I, like, find the next bonus? Nope. Did I get the G? And a really weird blast barrel that didn't really need to be there, by the way. Oh, don't tell me, this is the bonus. The difficulty of this level, getting to the ending. I also forget what the second last level is, though. I don't know what the last level is, it's Rip Pearl Reef. The most difficult level in the game, in my opinion. Maybe next, close to Lightning Lookout in, like, the, uh... Elephant running level there. Don't really like it. I feel like the cliff levels, other than Kong Fuse Cliffs and then one that we haven't seen yet, are pretty easy. Oh, rip actually, is Rip Curl Reef the last level? Gosh, it might be. Because wait, we had the pipe, 
the wharf, the tree, the cliff. No, there's, there's one more, I'm, I'm sure. Anyways, in the next episode, we'll do it, guys. So, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.